local listings. We are there are hundreds of cold cases in Jacksonville, and you could hold the clue to solving one of them. We're teaming up with JSO for a new podcast series, giving you rare access to help local families get justice. Download the Project Cold Case podcast at actionnewsjacks.com today. Take Action News Jacks with you everywhere. Download the app today. Weather information is everywhere, but here's what you won't find on your phone. Jacksonville's chief meteorologist, Mike Burrish, taking you beyond the data, live, in real time. That means you get the most recent, accurate forecast to plan your day. It's not just information about rain or the temperatures. It's the story behind the weather and its impact on you. Between 1 and 5 is the best time to get outdoors with the family this weekend. Every day on CBS 47 and Fox 30, weather coverage you can count on. Listen, we've all got to make choices. If you're hungry and you got five bucks, you could make a random meal playing dollar menu bingo. And fish sandwich. Or you can get a real meal with the Tarboro Double Cheeseburger. Spicy chicken sandwich, drink, fries, and look at this fresh baked cookie. Oh, word. The $5 All-Star Meal. It's four of them, and there's no better way to spend five bucks. Only at Hardee's. There is always this little fear, this, this cloud over you where you worry, is it going to come back? That's the worry. And that's the thing that, that is with me every day. There isn't a day that goes by where I don't think about it. Quitting is hard, but cancer is so much harder. Quit your way. Visit TobaccoFreeFlorida.com. Fox 30 Action News Jack to 10 begins with breaking news. CSX is dealing with the train issue in Mixon Town at the intersection of Dennis and Margaret Streets. Amtrak just told Action News Jack CSX had a six car derailment that is delaying Amtrak train 92 with 119 passengers, which is on its way to Orlando. Now we're working to get more details. And we'll keep you updated on air and online at actionnewsjacks.com. Good evening. I'm Ben Becker. Now, we have a crew on the way to that scene. Meantime, right now, an 11-year-old boy is in life-threatening condition after almost drowning in a retention pond. You think your kids are in 